Now, this is part two of three, and I show you a lot more work we've done to it. Now it was a TV or TE20 uh, converted to Paddle TVO made it into a TVD T TED, sorry. Now I wasn't happy with that. So I decided to go back to the original, which made it straight patrol. So I had a lot of changes to make. Now I only found out, well, about six months ago, that this tractor actually lay in the shade for about almost 30 years with cover over the changes that have been made have been Some might call them superficial, but it's back to its original TEA 20 patrol. No. <coughs> On the Patrol TVO, it was a key start that whoever had changed it over turned the key and it started it. But now the original, as Harry Ferguson did it, you have one, two, three, four, reverse. Sitting for about three months, never touched because I was away doing all the work and never got near it. But back to the original. Back to originality. As seen first second third 
fourth, reverse, start. Now that's the way it should have stayed, but didn't. But I'm glad it's I had to put a a complete new set of rubbers and the ball joints. And the set of tools for doing them was quite expensive. I must show them in tip three. Now I didn't take the heat shield off, I just left it on, but I I could take it off, I might consider it, but it's not doing any harm. And this is the starting handle. I must get a lock to put on it down here. Reason being, a mate of mine had his tractor at a rally last year. He came back, somebody had walked off with a starting handle. I kept the seat black. Now, in my first video, my first tip, I said I was going to put a, a roll bar on. I managed to get an original Ferguson roll bar. Which is very nice. Now to put the roll bar up. Two then. Just slip the pins in. I'm sorry the lighting isn't the best, but 
as the plaque says, it's a Ferguson roll bar. I got the lights working. Oh, a load of spawners on here. And uh, There's a, a Ferguson spawner. For 67 years of age, it's a beautiful little tractor, I think. Less than that, take over. Nice. I might, I might take the heat shield off at home. But it might confuse people of being a TED, but it's not. Now this is part two of three. I hope to make another video on it, tape on it, and I have a few more changes to make to it yet. Thank you for watching. Go to my website, Eric